In this video, I'm gonna show you three ways to automate your SEO. Welcome to All-in-One SEO. We make SEO easy with our powerful WordPress SEO plugin. Let's get started. The first thing you need to do to automate your SEO is install an SEO automation plugin. We're going to go ahead and install All-in-One SEO. If you already have AIO SEO installed, you can skip ahead to the next part of the video using the timestamps below. So let's go ahead and click on plugins and then click on the button that says add new. If you haven't done so already, we're gonna to wanna to download the plugin from AIOSEO.com. You're gonna to go to the account section into your download area and click the big green button that says download AIO SEO. And if you don't have an account already, you should be able to create one pretty easily. So back on the plugins page of your WordPress website, we're gonna go ahead and click the upload plugin button and then click choose file and choose the plugin file that you just downloaded. And then click the install now button. After the plugin installs, click the blue button that says activate plugin. After the plugin installs and is activated, the AIO SEO setup wizard will pop up automatically. We have another video that walks you through these steps and I highly encourage you to go through that wizard because it will just set up your whole website for success as far as your SEO efforts go. But for now, we're gonna head back to the dashboard. And then if you scroll on down the page and click the link, there's a space for us to enter our all-in-one SEO Pro license key. Back on our AIO SEO account, which you can find at aioseo.com slash account, make sure you're on the downloads tab. And then next to where it says license key, if you click on the icon, it will copy out our all-in-one SEO Pro license key. And then we're going to paste the license key into the license key field. Click connect. And that's it. All-in-one SEO Pro is activated on this website. If you want to be doubly sure, you can go ahead and click the blue Save Changes button. And then we're going to scroll up and click on the dashboard link just so we're all on the same page. So now that we have All-in-One SEO installed, one of the first things we can do to just get a real quick win is to automate how our titles are constructed. Let's head on over to the All-in-One SEO menu on the left and click on the link that says Search Appearance. And then on the links up top, click on the tab that says Content Types. So this is where we can control the appearance of various content types. So this first section here deals with post on our WordPress website. This next section deals with pages. This next section deals with products. I'm gonna focus on the post section right now for this example. So we can see here a preview of how our listing will appear in the search engine result pages. And below that, we can see the post title section, which I'm gonna focus on. The post title here is constructed of the actual title of the post the separator, site title, and this green check mark emoji. And if we look in the preview section, we can see it says sample post. That's the title of the post. This vertical bar is the separator. Demo site is the name of the site. And then we have this green check mark emoji. I can actually use any of the smart tags here to construct my post title. And I can click on the link that says view all tags or simply type in a hashtag symbol into the box and see all of the smart tags that are available. So. We could even include the month or the year in the post title if I wanted to do that. So let's say current year plus the post title plus separator plus the tagline. So we've got the year 2023, sample post is the title, separator is this vertical bar, tagline is site for SEO demo. So you can see how this works. So I'm gonna keep it simple and just put in the post title, the separator and I'm gonna put in a little happy face emoji here. Now it's worth mentioning that the best way to come up with a post title for your content is to do it on each individual page, read over your content and come up with the best, most catchy title that's gonna encourage people to click on it in the search engine result pages. But if you wanna automate things, this is the way to do it. And if you have a big existing site, maybe you just installed all-in-one SEO, you can do this and just get a quick win for all of your post titles. This can just clean it up right away while well, you have time to go into each individual post and create their own custom post titles. So when you're done doing this, you could also do the same thing for the meta description. I'm gonna leave what we have here as the default, the post excerpt, a separator, and the category title. And I'm gonna scroll all the way down and hit the save changes button. So that's the first way that you can use all-in-one SEO to help automate your SEO. A second way that we can 
automate our SEO is to put in automatic redirects anytime changing a URL would have created a 404 error or a broken link. So if we scroll back on up here, head on over to the all-in-one SEO menu on the left, and we're going to click on the link that says redirects. And then on the tabs up top, click on the tab that says settings. And if we scroll down here, there's a section that says automatic redirects. If we hover over this little question mark, it tells you that automatic redirects allows you to monitor changes to post types and automatically add redirects based on URL changes. So basically, if you were to go in and change one of your URLs without the all-in-one SEO plugin, that would result in a broken link. But what this can do is monitor when you change a URL and automatically put in a redirect to the new page. It can even monitor the trash. And if you throw some content out, it can put in a redirect for that content as well. If these toggle switches are not on, ensure that they are in the on position. Scroll down and click save changes and you're done. You have now implemented a second way to automate the SEO on your WordPress website. And then the third thing we can do to automate our SEO is not 100% automatic, but it will dramatically speed things up. I would call it semi-automatic, and that is to use our powerful Link Assistant feature. So head on over to that all-in-one SEO menu on the left and click on the link that says Link Assistant. We have another video that dives into all of the features of Link Assistant, and I will link to that video at the end of this video. But for right now, I just want to scroll down here to this section that says Linking Opportunities, and click on where it says see all linking opportunities. And if you watch that other video on Link Assistant, it'll tell you what all of these columns mean, but the one I'm interested in right now is this suggestions column. And this is giving me suggestions for links from one piece of my content to another piece of my content. So I'm gonna scroll down to this one that has 12 suggestions. This is for this post I have called The Secret to Resolving Credit Card Debt. So let's click this little arrow and open up that section we can see on this tab here, it's telling me there are 12 link suggestions. And I'm going to click where it says five outbound internal suggestions. So let's just look at the second one here as an example. There's this paragraph in this post that talks about debt relief. And it's saying, why don't you take that text, debt relief program, and link it to this post you have about Americans qualifying for a debt relief program? That sounds like a great internal link to me. It's awesome that All-in-One SEO can suggest this link to you. But the thing that makes it really powerful is I don't even have to open up this page. I don't have to go find this page in my post section and click edit. I can just click the link here that says add link and then confirm. Yes, I want to add this suggestion. And just like that, the link has been added to that page. And that's the third way that we can automate some of the SEO on our website by using AIO SEO's link assistant feature to help automate our internal linking. So those are three ways to automate your SEO. If you don't already have our awesome all-in-one SEO plugin installed, we've got a link to it in the description below this video. It can help you out with the task in this video as well as many other SEO jobs that you might have to do on your WordPress website. If you click on this next video right here, I'll show you how to add internal links fast using Link Assistant. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. For more tips and tricks on how to use our easy and powerful WordPress SEO plugin, all-in-one SEO.